All right, hey guys, Greg here. Uh, just thought I'd sign in and do a quick video. Haven't done one in a while. I was waiting to finish a uh, custom work, but I had it, and now I have it done, and time to review them. Uh, today I'm here with my good buddy Kevin, also a uh, YouTube name Dark Knight. That's Knight without a K. Hey, hi, Kevin. Yeah. What's up? And yeah, so. Customization work I did was on this dude. Boom. Dread wing. Yeah. And as I bring him in frame, you'll probably notice what the customization was. Yeah. This is the RID version of Dreadwing. Yes, the Powerizer version. And I customized that gun. Not as good as Zemgo did it, but I think it looks pretty darn cool. I did the same thing. I popped the batteries out of the case, disabled the spring, super glued the barrel, but then I did something he didn't do and painted it with these. My same old Sharpie paint markers, black and silver. And I think it just came out really cool. I tried putting a bit of red in the middle of the barrel, but it didn't come out too well. And for some reason on mine, this wing flap, on this right wing here, very, very loose. So I had to use one of those, one of the tie down elastics to hold it in place. Doesn't really affect much, you know, visual wise, but looks pretty good. And the way he's holding it is, here's the sword. Also a little bit of customized work, but I cut off the nib. Yeah, the peg nib. Cut it completely off and super glued it to the handle. So now he's holding it, and it's actually holding pretty steady. Super glued, a little, little bit of tape, and it holds pretty steady. Easily one of my favorite figures that I have so far. Um, and I'm not going to show a transformation vid because this weapon is a bitch to pull out now, and I don't want to break it. Um, but yeah, basically transformation is how he should be. Pop the shoulders up, spin the hands around, pop him out of that, and just fold him up so it fits properly. On mine, for some reason, he tends to stand a little crooked. Not so much today, but he's still standing. And he's standing okay. Got shot, I know, but... Not the greatest setup. It looks okay. Uh, the only problem is I don't have any place to store the sword now. And he can't hold it because of how big of, of the way him holding his gun. So I'm probably just going to leave it to the side. I'm not even going to probably... I'm not even going to use it. I might just find a plastic baggie and just throw it in there with, a, with like Starscream's gun and whatever. Uh... By the way, I'm still looking for someone to buy my R.A.D. Prime. I'm going to get the uh, first edition soon, and I want to get rid of it. Um, it's 15 bucks, complete, out of package, swords there, guns there, and the instructions. And, yeah, just want 15 bucks for it. So if you want it, PM me, and we'll go from there. Um, I've also posted a Craigslist ad for it. It's on the New Hampshire Craigslist, if you want it. It's there. So, yeah. Thanks for stopping right by, guys. Till next time, stay frosty.